side steps. Well done. So just be aware of how your ankles feel, make it as big or as small as you want, so you might want to make it bigger. Let's take the foot across this time, in front, tap across. If that doesn't work for your balance, just make it slightly in front, but if you can, take it all the way across, back to normal side step. I'm going to turn so you can see what I'm doing. So you're probably on the opposite leg to me now. I tried to switch, but it doesn't always work. So trying to touch the opposite heel, but if that doesn't work, then just take it a little toe tap behind. You're really feeling it in your bum. Touching my heel behind, turning to the side slightly, come back centre to face me, change to the other side, if that gets too much just take it to a little toe tap, back centre, foot across, maybe a little bit of a shake, you can stand on one leg, flick the leg softly across, or touch the toe in front, whatever feels right for you, for your body, to your workout. Take it back to a side step. Well done. Shifting across to your left, so slightly bigger, slightly smaller. Are you ready? We're going to make it two steps in a moment. Two steps, and back, well done. Little shuffle there to get on the beat. Hold it here, singles, double, single, well done, double, single, single. Well done. Let's change that slightly when we get to the end. You're going to come forward, for forward, and back, and back. Two. Two forward, two back. To the side for two. Two forward, two back. Two to the other side. Two forward, two. Two. Singles forward. Singles back. Double. Singles forward, well done. Particularly well done if I haven't confused you yet. <laughs> well done, just shake it. Catch the beat, right left, right left. So do what feels right for you in this. We're going to march quite wide in this routine. So just check that it feels right for you. Take it wide. So wide might be here, or it might be here. Might be lifting the knees nice and high. Make it right for you. I'm going to stay somewhere in the middle. Feet back in. Doesn't look very... It looks very ungainly, this one. Take it wide. Feet into the centre. Hold on. Two wide, two in. So it goes out, out, in, in. Make it as wide. or as small as you want. So it could be really wide at the arms if you can. Don't worry if you can't. Or just make it a small movement. Work with what feels right with your ankles. Marching in.
and take it wide or wider, whatever is right for you. Two and two out, in and wide. Hold it in, in. Take it wide. Let's do two each side. So, so tap and step, tap and step. Well done. If it doesn't work for you, if you can't quite get what I'm doing, make it up. As long as your body's comfortable and you're moving, it's all good. Well done. Marching in. Wide. Two in, two out. In. Well done. Catch the bead. We're going to go into side steps. Make sure you've got enough space to go two steps to the right. Let's take single steps for now. So if you need to, do a small step, take it across to this side. Tapping the toe across in front. So arms swing gently, shoulders are relaxed, well done. Head lifted. Think about pulling your tummy back where you'd like it to be. Take it back to normal side step. Well done. Let's swim with the arms, two steps, swim, and pull, swim, pull back, swim, pull back. I'm going to turn sideways so you can see what I'm doing. Pull back, swim, pull back, swim, pull back. Hold it here, single steps, relax those shoulders. We're gonna go back to those double side steps. Stay facing me, but I'm gonna turn so you can see a little bit what I'm doing this time. So two steps. I'm trying to keep the hands about shoulder height, so touch your shoulders, reach forward if you can. If that doesn't work, make it smaller, do what feels right for you, well done. So that's hurting your ankles, keep it smaller. Back to single side steps, relax the arms. Think about putting your belly in again. Keep breathing. Most important thing, keep breathing. You're gonna fall over otherwise. Well now, tapping that toe across in front. But challenging your balance slightly by taking that foot across. Well done. Side step. Some of these pieces of music are, seem to have odd beats. I'm sure it's not me. Let's do two steps. And pull. Pull. Stay the same with the arms. This time forward. Well done. Marching on the spot. I'm trying to lift these knees, those knees, your knees, <laughs> nice and high. Shoulders are relaxed, head lifted, lengthen the back of the neck. Well done. The higher you lift the knees, the harder it's going to be. So if you're new, a little bit overweight, or struggling, make it smaller if you need to. Your body, your choice. I'm 
I'm turning so you can see what I'm doing. We're going to go two forward, two back. Well done. Two forward, two back. Hold it here on the spot. Let's take it wide, or as wide as is comfortable. So just a little bit wider, or very wide, and lift the knees. Really up to you. Bring it in. Two forward, two back, so two forward. Now I want to put those two together. So we're going to go, can keep going forward and back. We're going to take it wider at the front, together at the back. So box step or V-step, forward and back. Wide at the front, together at the back. We're going to tap and change the lead leg in a moment. So we're right leg at the moment, left leg, right left and back. Are you ready? Four, three, two, tap change. So this leg comes out first. Don't worry if you haven't got it. Try and join me, right left. You can add your arms the same as me, really putting the arms out here so you can see which leg is going out first. You ready to do that tap change again? Let's go. This side, out. Well done. Tap change. Ready, tap change. So that's four. Three, well done. Two, don't worry if you haven't got it, it really doesn't matter, change size. Just keep moving, do what feels right for you. Just march on the spot if you've lost it. We need to do that for two on a tap change if you can. Again, don't worry if you can't. Tap change. Tap change for two, two, one, and change. Can we do singles? Maybe. Single, tap change. You can have a little twist if you want. What I find with this one, if you add a swing of the arm, it's a lot easier to keep those feet going where they need to go and twist. But if you want to keep it small, just keep it here, a little bit forward and back, changing the leg. Tap, step, step, tap. Step, 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 tap, well done. So make it big if you want. You can really swing it round. If you want to, make those steps nice and big, or you can keep it really small and, and not turn it at all. It's up to you. You've got to go with what feels right for your body, for your ankles. Well done. Side step. Well done. So beginning, beginning to bring the heart rate down a little bit now with a gentle movement. Put across the body. Well done. Just keep it gentle. Those arms relaxed. Let's take it two steps. Catch your breath. If you're still feeling a little bit breathless now, please, 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 make it smaller. This is our cool down, getting us nice and relaxed. Single side steps. Keep it as small as you need to, make it comfortable. Almost on the spot now. Take that foot behind. Hold the right foot back, push it down, push it down, So if feet are about hip width apart, you should be able to balance nicely. If your feet are too close together, you're going to struggle with this. I'm going to turn so you can see what I'm doing. Let's hold that heel down, 
lean slightly forward. The front knee is above the ankle, but just the foot. So it might need to be a little bit further away if you're not feeling the stretch in here in the calf muscle. If that's too tight, bring it here. Relax forward, relax your back, relax your upper body, lean on the leg if you need to. And just hold that stretch for down. Let's change sides. Taking the other leg back. Lift and lower. Return to the other side. So again, my feet are fairly wide. They're wide enough to be balanced, lifting up onto the toe, pushing the heel down. Adjust that front leg so that as you straighten the leg, whether it be here or whether it be here, that you're getting that heel just to the floor. Let's hold that there. Well done. Feel the stretch in your calf. Relax the upper body. Well done.